we just refinished our cabinets. Hello everyone in Cyber World. Welcome back to another video. I'm Richard, also known as Poor Man. And I'm Jennifer, also known as Mrs. Poor Man. And today we're going to show you how we did our kitchen cabinet makeover. Okay, this kitchen cabinet makeover was done the poor man's way. Um, instead of spending a ton of money having entire cabinets ripped out, um, we're going to show you how we did um, a makeover, in essence, with just some couple cans of, of paint, uh, of one can of primer and one can of semi-gloss uh, paint. Um, obviously there's some more things involved. Uh, uh, you could use just rollers. In our case we used a sprayer and we'll, um, we saved a little bit of time and it came out much much nicer by doing rollers. Uh, we've done the rollers in the past and they work just fine. Um, but it, again the sprayer just makes the finish look much prettier because there's absolutely no paintbrush marks. Um, but again this whole project was done quite inexpensively, like I said, the poor man's way. And if you enjoy our videos, please like, comment, or subscribe. And with that, cue, cue music. music. So here is what we started with. The first step was to mark each box in order to reinstall the cabinet doors in the proper location. It's demo time! Actually, we carefully removed all the cabinet doors. Next, we removed the hardware and stored them in individually marked baggies. We also marked the cabinet doors to identify which box they match up to. We had far too many doors to paint at once, so we started with the smaller upper cabinet. In order to paint the cabinets, we drilled pilot holes and screwed in cup hooks to hang the cabinet doors on hangers. This was done in order to paint both sides of the cabinet doors at once. We went from this, a coat of primer and a couple coats of paint, and got this. While waiting for the paint to dry, we started prepping the boxes. Now it's time to start painting. We did so with a coat of primer. Then a few coats of white paint. It's time to paint the large cabinets and we need special help. Once the painting was done, we reinstalled the hinges. Next, we rehung the cabinet doors and made necessary adjustments to line them up properly. We purchased new handles and installed them to help make the cabinets look new.
And here's how our project turned out. We hope you enjoyed our video today. And next week, we're going to show you one of our workshops from Japan. And until then, bye-bye.